hi everyone this is lakshman welcome back to our youtube channel in this video i am going to talk about uh, recently one of my friends has attended the one of the interview uh, with one of the biggest financial company in hyderabad so his experience is discussed with me so i planned that one uh, to upload on the one video uh, regarding uh, the real time selenium with java entry question so these questions are very useful who are uh, attending for three years experience candidates so the entry is a uh, process is going on like this the first round will be face to face interview and next round will be a uh, manager round and then hr round so the first round will be face to face then he has some experience so the first question is introduce yourself so this is the uh, first question wherever you go the first question should be uh, introduce yourself so he introduce uh, his details and his experience and everything the next question is how much rate give uh, in java for 5 points then he immediately uh, said that out of five uh, is given the points four so he immediately starting to ask the core java entry questions the first question is uh, tell me about access specifies in java so how many uh, access specifies are there in java so uh, the next question will be what is the difference between uh, default and private access specifies The next one, what is the difference between abstract class and interface? The next question, can we create object for interface? Next, he immediately asks the question, uh, write the logic uh, to check the number is Armstrong or not. The next question, so he has given uh, one number pattern and then he asked to write the logic for that pattern. So this is the pattern to write the logic for this number pattern. So he has given paper and pen and uh, he asked to write the logic for this one. And the next question is, can we declare class with final keyword? Next, we ask the uh, write a uh, simple abstract class with example. Then, how to use abstract class in our project? So, how you are achieving the abstract class in your project? He, he has to ask some uh, project related question also based on OOPS concept. There. Then, he asks him how many types of exception. Then, he immediately asks. How to resolve null pointer exception in test engine? Then uh, he asked about the uh, Selenium web driver. So how to launch a web browser? And he asked to write the code also. You need to uh, write the script to launch the web browser. Then he asked whenever you write the logic for how to launch web browser. You should write this uh, statement. So in this statement, uh, he asked again, "What is web driver? And what is driver? What is new Chrome driver? Web driver is his class or interface?" He asked like that question. Next question: Why we cannot create object for interface? He asked like that. So here we are creating the object for Chrome driver class, but web driver is the interface. We are not creating the object for interface. Then why you are not unable to create the object for interface? The next question: What is the meaning of a dynamic file master? The next question: What frameworks used in your project? The next question: Suppose I want to ex I executed two thousand test cases, but in that Test cases, 500 test cases are paid. 
then how to execute failed test cases i don't want to execute 2000 test cases again i want to execute only 500 test cases then how to uh, execute failed test case he asked like that question so i asked to write the uh, test script uh, for that scenario the next question is i don't want to execute some test cases then how can uh, we skip those test cases suppose there are uh, 10 test cases are there test methods are there i don't want to uh, execute some uh, test methods i want to skip those test methods then how uh, we are go we are going to skip the test method the next question is how to take a screenshot for failed test cases so write the uh, test script for that one so he also asked that one to write the uh, logic to write the script how to take screenshot for failed test cases and finally he asked uh, uh, draw your framework architecture of your project okay so these are all the uh, he faced in the first round they are all technical entry questions from core java and selenium and test engine so i hope uh, these entry questions very helpful for who are having a, about 3 years of experience candidates so please subscribe to our youtube channel i will make upload more and more videos uh, real time entry questions in coming sessions so thank you for watching